Moving toward Norman now, the city remains quiet as schools and businesses closed due to the weather. Yeah, that's where we find News 9's Augusta McDonald, who joins us live with more details there. Augusta. Colby, Bobby, we spent uh, the better part of the day here in Norman experiencing a couple different waves of sleet that came through this morning. We now know there's over an inch of sleet that's accumulated. If you look at the secondary roadways, you can see where that's piled up. We have seen lots of crews throughout town, especially on the, the main roadways, clearing sleet and laying down salt laying down sand, so there is uh, work going on here. But you know, overall, today in Norman was a pretty quiet day. Oh, we've got a car spinning out here. We're seeing this at uh, a lot of intersections and on ramps. You know, it's just very slick, so people are sliding around. Definitely important to still go slow. Norman police reporting today they did not see a big uptick in calls, and the city was pretty quiet. OU was virtual, Norman Public Schools was virtual, and a lot of businesses in town were closed, so Props to the city of Norman. Everybody kind of stayed home, did the did the smart thing today, and, and it shows in the numbers. It's been a pretty safe day. I've also been tracking EMSA's call numbers in Oklahoma City. They experienced seven car crashes. They responded to three cold exposures and two outdoor falls. They just want to remind everybody, if you're walking around outside, definitely put on some cleats and be very careful. Live in Norman, Augusta McDonald for Oklahoma's own News 9.